This short tutorial demonstrates the basic features of Data Gene Web version. You can watch more on our YouTube channel or see examples from our online help. Use the link at the top to register. Registration is free and only takes a few seconds. Data Gene allows you to build multiple projects. In this example we will create some realistic artificial data. Give your project a name and click the check button. A project must contain at least one table. This is where we will define how many rows and columns we want to generate. Type in the number of rows you want for this table and click the check button to create the table. Now we can create columns for our customer's table. A column will determine the type of data that will be generated. Give your column a name and select from the drop-down list of column categories the identifiers and look up. Notice the new options that appear. Different data types will require different options allowing you to control the output generated. Customer ID column will be an auto-generated number starting at 10,000 in increments of 3. Click the check button to create the column. Now let's create another column. This column will contain a realistic name. Select both genders from the drop-down list. Data Gene allows users to create their own values and control how often they appear in the rows generated. Select lists from the category drop-down. In this example we will create a column with values bachelors, masters and PhD. Type the values separated by the vertical pipe character. Now type the distribution ratio separated by colon. In this example PhD will be generated for 20% of the rows. Data Gene allows you to create numbers and dates with the required characteristics. Let's create a uniform random number. Select numeric from the category drop down. Type the minimum and maximum number you would like to be generated. Now let's generate the data. Click on the back to tables option and then click the preview button. Now click the customers tab to preview your data. Once you are satisfied with the design of your project, select the desired export format and click the order button.